Yo, what is good, Ninja? OG over here from Player Essence, and welcome to another PE gameplay video. Today, we're taking a look at the Ukulele Nintendo Switch version of the game. Shout outs to Team 17 and also uh, Playtonic Games for the review code. But with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get right into this, Ninja. Right, we're going to start off a new game here. We're going to check out the port now, just to let you guys know. Um, I do, or I have, I have already played this game on the Xbox One. So I played the game on the Xbox One. Um, I thought it was cool, but this style of platformer has never been uh, my favorite. Like Even in the N64 days, I wasn't a big fan of Banjo-Kazooie. I wasn't a big fan of just like uh, Conker and those type of 3D platformers. I like Super Mario 64, but even that isn't my favorite like Mario game. Like It's not like my favorite all time out there. Now that doesn't have any effect on how I'm going to like this game or not. Like I'm gonna judge it on the controls and how faithful of a port is. So don't worry about that. But I just want to give you guys some uh, some backstory, you know, into you know my my experience, you know. But definitely not hating on this style of game at all. Like I, I think we need more of this style of game, more more so than anything. So it's really cool that Platonic uh, brought this back because there's a lot of fans who do like this style of game. So far, so good. Looks pretty faithful to the Xbox One version from what I can see. Everything has been prepared to your specifications, capital B. The workforce is now yours. Hmm. Do you think this new, this new statue is golden enough? Or too golden? Oh, it's um focus test. It. These employees need someone to look up to. Hold on. What is that? That's the vice president statue, sir. I didn't sign off on that. Plus, it's it's casting an awkward shadow on the president's plinth, Bennett. Of course, you're the boss now. Now, now we are ready to synergize your latest profit plumping technology, Dr. Quack. Yes, sir. I prepared the Novelizer, the Novelizer 64, my most ingenious invention. We can use it to steal all the dusty old books in the world and leave us as the only player in the market. An equally ruthless and dynamic strategy, Doctor. I like it. Prepare the device immediately. I want to be on World 4's golf course by lunchtime. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Here we go. So jacking all the books in the world, and I guess we gotta stop them. And quack, make sure you secure the special book. And there goes all the books. Like I said, it looks pretty faithful to the Xbox uh, One version from what I can remember. I'm probably sure there's been some side-by-side -side comparisons and people counting pixels and frames with with fine point pens, but hey, <laughs> I'm just gonna play the game and see how it plays and I'll give you guys my opinion on it. Ah, uh, this is the life. I think this old shipwreck finally feels like home. Lately. That'll be my vibrant paint job, Yuka. It's about time you renovated this place. Most of the rooms haven't been touched since we moved in. Text goes slow. I gotta speed up the text somehow in the options. Who knows what's hiding under the floorboards? Insects mainly. Delicious, they were. Oh, and some old book I've been using as a drinks coaster. Whoa. Pirate treasure. I bet that's worth loads. It looks antique. 
Really? Do you reckon we should flog it? I'll split I'll split you 80-20 in my favor. Hey, my pocket book. It's being sucked away. The pages. They're escaping. And they're golden. I think that book is a bit more special than you thought, Lady. Quick, after it. It's worth even more now. It's a flying book. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into the control. Nice. Feels feels good. Alright, I don't I forgot the controls too though. <laughs> Alright. No, it feels good though. I'm playing with the Pro Controller. Using the camera to. There's the new manual camera, which is good. You can move the camera around. Let's run up the ship here. That's the crouch. Just press the A button to do the little. Tungil. Isn't there like a roll button? Probably. Either way. Let's continue on here. I thought that was like a spin attack. We'll get to that. Alright, pals. Lovely to see you. Hi there. I'm Yuka, and this is my buddy Laylee. Do we know you? Of course, it's me, Trouser, the honest and dexterous salesman. Yeah, I remember. You're the crook who sold us that dodgy flat screen. Nope, not me. You're surely mistaken, friend. Hey, Trouser, did you happen to see a magical flying book go through here? For five quills I did. They're in demand now. This book business has kicked off. Perhaps you can find enough of, of uh, enough in those treasure chests lying around. I already tried lockpicking those while Yuka was asleep. No chance. Ah, to unlock them, you'll need one of my trademark special moves. By using Y, our green friend here can perform the, uh, the tail twirl attack. There you go, I had to get it from him first. I forgot. <laughs> Press Y to attack. Got it. Excellent. Now go whack those treasure chests and bring me my five quills. Right, let's... Okay, a little HD... HD Rumble? What the? Each attack? I'm a quill. One of 200 in each world. Collect us to, pur to purchase new moves. Is it HD Rumble? Or it's just normal Rumble? It's pretty much just... It's kind of like... Whenever you hit something, it's there. Although the camera just kind of... It looks kind of weird when you... Well, it moves on its own. Yeah, it'll rotate on its own at any point. Yeah. Oh, there's three. Oh, there you go. There's the little. It's still solid. It feels great though. It does. It, it it feels good to play another 3D platformer in this vein. You know, even though I'm not the biggest on this style of franchise, it still feels good to play. You know. Five. Ah, uh, yes, that seems to be enough to jog my memory. Come back here. Alright. Ooh, in just a second. Let me, let me hop up. Well, there's a barrel. Break that barrel. Got a butterfly. Hmm, I'm, t I'm tasty butterfly energy. Be nice and collect me to refill your power bar. Alright. We will definitely do so. This type of game playing down, like lying down in bed, would be great. <laughs> I say that a lot, but honestly, I honestly like, I really think that it'd be pretty cool. I'm probably gonna play this just like relax, play some ukulele. I, I never finished it on Xbox One. I think I just played like, the first level for you guys, you know, and that was it. <laughs> but I'll definitely probably play this more on the on the Switch. Mm, I'm tasty. Mm -hmm. I hear ya. 
I hear you, dude. Hey, yeah. Hmm. Hey. Tasty butterfly. Probably some more stuff, but let's go ahead and continue on here. Oh, some move, nice movement options there. Yeah, so overall, from what I can see with the frame rate and the, you know how it looks, it's a pretty, it's a good faithful port. And the fact that you can play it anywhere you want, definitely check it out. Um, if you want to have that action as far as playing it on the go, playing it at home, it's it's nice. It feels good. Strange things going on in there since the takeover by Hyvory Towers Court. I'm headed there myself to uh, sell some moves. Allow me to raise the gate. Come on, Yuko. Let's get that book back before Trouser realizes we didn't give him those quills we found. <laughs> See ya. All right, so let's get let's go over here. Use the beat to jump. Crouch underneath it. Oh, okay. Crouch. Yeah. Stay. blue things up there. They look even shiftier than Trouser. May maybe they're lost. I doubt it. If um, I were us, and I'm 50% of us, then I'd attack them with Y. Unlike those soft shooters, our uh, health bar won't auto-refill. You're right, <laughs> but if they do attack us, I can always eat a nearby butterfly by pressing A to gain some health. Enemies? Huh, interesting. Hey. It feels good to bash people in ukulele, though. Right, let's go to move on here. No trespassing. This is private property. Hello, we're searching for our missing book. It looked like it went this way. Your book belongs to us now, as will most of the world's supply. Before long. Mwahahaha. That's a weird business plan. Are you opening a bookmobile? Actually, it's just one book in particular we're interested in. Now, scram before I call security. There's something not right about this place lately. We should investigate. I love how it says no trespassing in the door. Just opens wide open for us to go in. That's awesome. <laughs> hey friends over here how did that snake get here so quack so fast so quack so fast <laughs> lovely to see you again pals i see you've got up to speed with your basic moves you could give himself a short tutorial on the way in smashing time to put your skills to work I've spotted a piece of your book. <laughs> that happy book page right there. Um, why don't you go ahead and collect it and find out what's going on? I'd, um, I'd go myself, but I've got an important call coming up with the World One boss <laughs> after one of my super moves. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> This game is cool. I love the throwback puns and stuff that they use, you know, for old school gaming. Love it. 
So last time when I played this on the Xbox One, I actually had to edit it because I kept on falling for some reason because of the controls or the camera. I wasn't really sure. Just like there's like I guess like a little bit of input delay in the control. I'm not exactly sure why I kept falling. Now that might still happen here, but I do feel that this is the latest version of the game. You know when it comes to updates and everything. So I feel like I'm probably gonna do a bit better here. I think we'll we'll see what happens. <laughs> Alright, so... I'm not exactly sure what that is, that's fine. Oh, it's gonna make me slide. Okay. Continue on here. Oh, about to go. Alright, and here you are. Hello there, who might you be? I'm a pagey. I live inside the all powerful one book. One the one book? How much is one of those worth? The one book is incredibly powerful, and it's been stolen by the evil Captain B. If Captain B unlocks the power within, his crooked company will have the power to rewrite the universe. Luckily, us pages have fled the one book and gone into hiding. Without pages, the one book is just an empty shell. If you use me to unlock one of the grand tombs in this factory, we can transport to another world and search for more of my friends. Don't worry, we'll help you, Paigey. Come on, Laylee. It's uh, let's find one of those grand tombs and search for more Paigeys. You, Laylee, is the hero that we all deserve. Hey, pals, I believe I can assist you on your quest. Why don't you come and see me for the details? Say, you two chaps need to explore those grand uh, tombs, and I'm looking to expand my business uh, to new locations. How about we make a deal? For every grand tomb you unlock, I'll help your quest with a new move, free of charge. That sounds like a good deal, Trouser. We're in. Super, your first complimentary move is one of my trademark abilities. If you hold down ZR, you'll get the grip you need to roll up slippery ramps. Nice. There's one note in the small print, pals. The longer you use this move, the more you'll drain your power bar. So roll wisely. Instead of eating butterflies, you can collect them to refill your power bar. Nice. Why don't you try uh, your new trouser patented maneuver on that nearby slippery ramp? Okay. We'll try out this new move and then we'll pretty much end this video right here, guys. Alright, thank you, trouser. Okay. There we go. Yo. Look, Laylee, a pagey in a cagey. <laughs> Amazing. Poet didn't, didn't even know it. Help, capital B's uh, corporate minion locked me in this metal prison. These pamphlets sure are pushy. Come on, then. Tell us where the key is. There's no key. Cages are unlocked by solving nearby puzzles, but you've not learned, or you, you've not yet learned the correct move to help me. Okay, Paigey, we'll come back for you later. Alright. So I have not learned the correct move, so we'll just continue on here. Alright. Hey, you made it to the first Grand Tomb. The Grand Tombs are magical gateways to new worlds. Ivory Towers seems to have captured many, but only us Pages can unlock them for you. Stand on the switch 
and if you have collected enough pages, we can unlock it for you. Yeah, yeah. Then we go inside and rescue more of you, right? That's right. Once inside, don't forget to find Trouser. It sounds like those moves he sells will help you out in, um, on your adventure. Alright, let's open up. It will cost one page to unlock this world. Do you do you want to unlock? The Tribal Stack Tropics? Yes. Right, we'll unlock this. Return here later and I'll reveal more about the Grand Tombs. So that's basically uh, the first level here, guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Um, if you guys do like this enough, go ahead and hit that like button. Um, subscribe if you're someone new. And if we get enough likes here and we get enough people who watch the video, I'll definitely upload another gameplay video of ukulele running on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, so far, I think it's a fantastic port. I think it plays really well. So if you're interested in this game and you want to have a version that you can take anywhere you want, uh, I definitely think the Nintendo Switch version will be a good version for you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Uh, like I said, hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll definitely see you guys for the next gameplay video. Peace out, Ninja.